Good morning, brother. Just woke up literally five minutes ago. Retainer still in mouth. It's one of those nights where you just fall asleep on the couch. Last night, had a little late night. Went to the beach, you guys saw, maybe on my Instagram story or my Snapchat. Brought my last meal, was just eating it on the beach by myself. And um, I w it was like 1.30 a.m., and I was there, I thought it was just me, and then these group of like, probably like six or seven kids, like came, and I kind of got scared, because I thought I was, like, I was gonna get my shit jumped, just there, like you guys know that scene from uh, Karate Kid, couples like, you know, laying down on a blanket together, probably having like deep conversations, I went up to the group and I was like, um, excuse me guys, uh, is there room for one more? And they said yes, so. I sat on the blanket with them. We just had good talks. But nah, I wish that did happen. But two Rice Krispie wrappers here. I don't know how that happened, but. <sighs> Dehydrated as fuck. Let me drink some water. But I'm gonna eat breakfast. Maybe go outside. Start my day. And uh, I'm gonna bring you guys along. <laughs> All right, just poured up some electrolytes in this glass bottle obviously i'm gonna drink this down i would go outside right now but you guys want to see what it's looking like outside right now <laughs> honestly not as bad as i thought let me take this retainer out because i can't speak ah it's not even that bad outside but um Real quick, I want to let you guys know that these shirts are now available. Link is in description. If you want to support me personally, I'd appreciate it a lot. Everyone who already picked up a shirt, thank you guys. I hope you enjoy. Back to the video. Oh, fuck. I'm about to cook up some breakfast here. I only have five eggs. Normally, I do six. I'm going to have sit or five eggs on two bagels and maybe some oatmeal, too. I'm going to see, but... No, I didn't put any spray. Go Some of you guys are getting on my ass the other day. Why'd you lick it before saying that? Before saying because there's a little bit of excess egg yolk. Uh, egg yolks. Oh, now you know. you're stuttering. I'm nervous, right? <laughs> Talking about oh, you don't toast your bagels enough. This is how like a bagel should be toasted. There's some crunch to it, and it's not burnt or anything, but facts. Slightly toasted. So I'm gonna uh, get my uh, eggs ready. Hot sauce, Frank's Red Hot, CO. Honestly, thank you to whoever made this. I'm gonna tell you guys a little something. So I buy a big thing of it from Costco and then I just refill the bottle. I use the funnel like this to like break, put it in the big tub from the bottle to the bottle. <coughs> I would take the big tub and I would put this into the bottle and refill it. The Frank's Red Hot stained the funnel forever. Literally, like the one I have at home, it's still stained red all on the inside. So what is it doing to my esophagus? You know, and I just drink this shit every single day. But yeah, I'm gonna uh, put some of this on. This guy's eggs, bro. I know, I burnt it too long. I got a little distracted. A little crispy. Should I just make new ones? Do you have new ones? No, I would never do that. Are you struggling, bro? I am, bud. All right, we're gonna fold it up here. Pat. And you wanna put it down on the side where it's not the thicker part of the bagel. And then you wanna apply. More? Yes, buddy. Blood cleat. And then there you go. All right, first bite, Tesco. It's too hot to eat. Normally, oh, you normally I let it sit two to three minutes, let it cool down, um, maybe pick a YouTube video for me to watch, and then um, we eat it, but. We'll do a taste test later on. Thank you. All right, sitting outside now, of course. Gonna eat this up. I'm watching my boys cross this newest YouTube video, so I'm gonna eat this, enjoy it, sit in the sun a little bit, soak in some vitamin D, and then uh, get ready for the day. This is one of my more pathetic bowls, but it's all right. Uh, you're, we gotta go grocery shopping, so we'll bring you guys along for that, but I'm gonna eat this up and then carry on. Cute little setup you have here, buddy. Sufficient, bro. Where's nope. your water bottle at? Where's your water bottle at? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I thought you're gonna offer to fill mine up. Fill you want to, me to? Fill it to the brim, please. 
Well done. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh, sorry, I'm, lo I'm looking at something else. Crazy, right? <laughs> that shit went right to the top, though. Let's see. Accuracy. It's because I'm a bartender. Are you? No, sir. Uh, oh, you guys are asking, yo, Michael, what do you smell like? Give me some reviews. No one in their life has asked that. All right, no one's asked that, but it's all right, because I got a dimple. But here we go. You guys probably have not heard of this. It's called Versace. Right? So we have it here. I've used it for quite a bit. Um, I never really get close enough to anyone for them to even smell me. So it's almost a waste of money of me putting it on every day. But I'm going to teach you guys on how you're going to want to put it on. So you're going to go one squirt on the left chest. Bam. Another on the right. Bam. Then you're going to get it on the back of your palm. Ew, I just breath, breathe some of it in. And then you're going to want to rub it. No, I'm playing. You want to tap along your forearm and along the inside. And then you're going to want to do it on the other bruh like this tap tap don't rub you'll fuck up the scent just know <sighs> cheated on your man you can get it if you want it all right all right and then you're gonna want to leave one on the back of your neck just so when you walk past these bitches in the gym uh they get a whiff of your pheromones There we go. That's pretty much it. If you guys want to check it out, shout out my boy Jeremy. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, mm. all right, we're about to go head to the grocery store. We're going to pick it up. Uh, no money, act like money isn't everything. I'm having a good time. They just trying to ruin it. Shout out to the fact that I'm the youngest nigga doing it. Cat bone grim bitch. Say fuck your life. Okay, now we out of here. Two to see you bitches. And oh, whatever, man. Fuck what they be talking about. They opinion doesn't count. We the only thing that matters. Uh, I got that kind of money, make a pro bitch better. I got that kind of wait, wait, fix it. Which bitch you know made a million off a mixtape? Real thing, eh? Real Toronto man just came out there. I pull up in Lexus like it's 07. I just hit it like I'm in the next one. Look what I've done in my life. I had to count it, then count it again to make sure the money was right. They let it talk. Me, I'm just done in the hype. Me, I'm just done in the hype. Me, I'm just done, 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 done. Oh my god, I look so good. <laughs> I look so good in this light. And you just gotta trim too. I know that comes at an all time high. Look at this camera. Alright guys, just got to Walmart. We gotta do a little grocery haul. The fridge is looking a little dry, so we're gonna pick up some essentials and I'm gonna bring you guys along with me oh this looks good on you too sun kissed if you guys are on my snap you already know i posted my full list of groceries that i had to pick up so uh it's very helpful so shout out to me and right now we're just getting some strawberries blueberries and raspberries all for the oatmeal grown ass man just kidding but you can't do it. Sorry, right, man. sorry. Let's see what else we need to get. Yes, yes, I know, I know. I know, buddy. <laughs> All right, we need some eggs. Pasture-raised eggs only, I swear. What's the price difference in pasture and the other? Bro, this is you guys know I, uh, I'm a big fan of my eggs. A little tip, you, just, you check the eggs to see if it's uh, cracked or anything. Cause you don't want to pick the shitty ones. These ones are good. I'm gonna get two packs of 18. Cause honestly, yo, I probably eat anywhere from like six to 10 eggs a day. I love eggs. I love them. Easy protein. Easy protein tastes good and very nutrient dense. Oh, we need pepper as well. Black pepper in the cart right now. <laughs> What else do I need? Let me check my list. Next up on the list, ground beef. Ground beef. Oh! <laughs> it's 17 bucks for a grass-fed beef. And for normal, for a pack like this, it's 15. Santa Cruz Medicinal, sir, I'm sorry. I don't give a fuck that much. 
There's no way. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Bro, 17 bucks? 17 bucks for a pack like this? And this pack is 15. For like double. You actually have to have money. Literally. Ew, I don't give a fuck. I'm getting ground beef. Extra lean ground beef. Yo, where's the extra lean? Oh, this is it. Next up on the list, we gotta get some, you know, diet soda, diet something. But I mean, if you're cutting, diet diet pop is a hack. But I would limit to like one can a day, honestly. But let's see the options they have here. They got the Diet Coke, the Sprite, Fresca, what else? Diet Root Beer is good, Pepsi, I think. It's the toughest decision of my life, bro. Oh, I need water too. I think I'm gonna go with the Diet Pepsi. Comment below, yo, what is your favorite diet soda? I know like, you know, there's a little debate, Diet Coke, Diet Pepsi. I'm a Diet Pepsi kind of guy, but I think that's what we're gonna go with today. My favorite drink ever though, is water. Yo, my favorite game to play is cashier, honestly. I wish I wasn't so ethical or else I'd be like saving a bunch of money. Approved. Just, just making sure he's not stealing or anything. Nothing. Nothing, nothing. Is that your phone? <laughs> Pack up your stuff, grocery boy. <laughs> no, my gym shark undies. <laughs> These are from when I jumped in the water. And yeah, I just, they look a little I, brown. I just go naked. Oh, it must be a shit stain. That's actually disgusting for me to throw them on you. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's I, I very nice. That is disgusting. Oh, your ass is gonna be. Ew, pe Diet Pepsi is nasty, bro. It's not, bro. I, I swear to God, no sugar Coke is way better. I was, Coke I was, Zero? I clears. said, yo, which one's your favorite? Diet Coke or Diet Pepsi? Because there's, I know, you know the little debate and shit. It's but. Not, Diet, not Diet Coke, though. It has to be Coke Zero. Coke Zero clears. I don't think so. It, I promise you it clears. Nah, I banged my elbow. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna head home. Holy, look at that. Look at all the groceries this guy got. Show him. Go. That's a money spread right there, you know. That's a money no, spread. No, sorry. It... <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What happened? That Paula guy was like, what the fuck are you recording? Oh. Uh, Buddy. Which one? The bot guy? Oh, oh, fuck. Yeah, no. Okay, go. Yo, continue. Nah, <laughs> he's like, yo, what the fuck? We were trying to show you the guys, uh, all the guys' groceries behind us. And then Luke goes to point it over to him. The guy walking past is like, what, who the fuck are you recording? And I said, Buddy. There's an issue. I actually didn't say anything. I just looked at him like that. And he hushed up, got on his knees and apologized. Nice, close it properly. Good slam. Good stuff. Watch, watch, I'm gonna turn it. Not me. <laughs> but like, come walk with me this way. Alright. Ready? Yes, bro. Ready? You can't be near me. You can't be. Go that way. Yo, you got the keys? Yep. Yep. Taking a moment, my boy Jorge. Uh, you know, if you guys ever taken a moment throughout your day, you want to just prop up your phone, take a little video, send it to me. I appreciate it. I like to know that you guys are, you know, enjoying the moment. So, thank you to those who sent it to me. Cut. All right, guys. Welcome to another video. Just got to the gym. I'm coming off of two rest days, so I'm feeling nice and rested. As you guys saw, I quit the last video, but I think I'm gonna give it a second chance. I'm feeling good. Um, gonna go hit chest right now, eating a Rice Krispie, and um, yeah, we're about to go crush it. 
I like the way you kiss me. Da 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 da. Great car, man. It's a nice C8. You see my TikToks or something? Yeah, yeah. Let's go, bro. Let's get a pic. Awesome, man. What is your name, Mike? Mike. Nice to meet you. You go by Mike or Mike? Yeah, I might have to start going by Mike. Yeah, yeah. Hey, send me down on Instagram or tag me or something. Nice meeting you, bro. Yes. Ah. Pokemon, catch them. Let's go. Chest. Nah. TikTok, so first of all, bam, post on all platforms, TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube. YouTube, I would say, is the best overall platform right. uh, because it's long form. People can see how you really act, right? Yeah. Because you know, I'm sure you see, you see a bunch of videos like of people in the fitness industry, same shit, posing, workouts, you know, strength, something like that. So yeah. the one thing to make yourself different to compare to everyone else is you and your personality because no one that's, is you, right? Yeah, that's so that's true. the one thing that separates everyone one and YouTube allows you to showcase that long form and from there you can clip it up and then share it to your you know Instagram TikTok but at the same time I would say post on Instagram and TikTok too like your typical like workout videos because then you can funnel it into the YouTube because it is easier to grow off of Instagram and TikTok All right. so I would say do that put your personality in the videos that's a big thing yeah because yo followers aren't everything having a sh having a strong community is better than having yeah. hundreds of thousands really of followers because I would rather have 10,000 locked in loyal supporters than like a hundred K random followers yeah. who just like like my picture and that's it and those same like community too they're gonna be engaging in all your posts you know using your code or whatever if you're trying to like turn into a business kind of thing post often bro every day multiple times yeah. a day right. across everything I'm about to actually do a whole YouTube video in detail like bro, I have like four or five pages in the notebook of okay. everything so you need to watch the video because right, yeah, it's definitely be very helpful yeah. um let me think because i what about like getting like a better camera and stuff like that no so, you don't no. need a better camera it's not the camera has nothing to do with it what phone do you have i found like 13 that's perfect yeah. really i like, fix the settings on my phone so like it works yeah 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 but, like, it's all you need bro like right. you don't need a fancy camera because oh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally. the camera on the iphones are good enough now to like the quality's there yeah and I would just get used to just talking in front of the camera. Something that I like to remind myself about talking in front of the camera, just imagine the camera is your boy, like your boy. Talk to the camera like how you would talk to your boy. Yeah, literally though, right? Talk to the camera like you would talk to your boy. That's yeah. it, and it's just gonna come off a lot more natural. And always be yourself, because people get see through the bullshit. Yeah. They can see when you're putting on an act, you know, like no one's like, ah, happy and shit all yeah. the time, you know? So literally be 100% yourself, and that's gonna attract people with similar interests that you have too that are also similar to you and your personality and then you're slowly just gonna build a little community respond to every comment every dm reach out first if someone's commenting stuff on yourself be like yo i appreciate the support something like that all right going live helps a lot too because it it shows your supporters what you're like in real time and you're able to answer their questions personally because if they're in the live they're watching asking comments you can give a response in real time okay so that's like pretty much like i'm kind of doing that right now so like it's a lot of luck too, right? Like there is a good there is a good amount of luck. Up. But the thing with the luck is 
everyone has lucky days, but if you're consistent every day, you're gonna get a lot more of those lucky yeah, yeah. days, you know? That's true. So that's why you just gotta consistently post right. and you'll run into those lucky days. Everyone I know, I know so many people that ask me, oh, how do I grow my account? I know a lot of people that post content, but the only people I know that are doing content full time is like three or four people personally that I know. And those people just stay consistent over the years, yeah. right? Everyone else that wanted to do it, stop. And nothing really came out of it because they stopped. But everyone I know that stayed consistent with it is doing it now full time. If you want to just do it for fun or like as a job, that's that, that's fine too. But like, it'd be cool to like make some money off that's true, yeah. something you're passionate about. And if you're really passionate about working out, making content, whatever it is, if you're consistent enough with it and it, you're something that you're passionate about, you'll figure your way out and yeah, yeah. make it work. Because if it's something you're passionate about, you're going to be a lot, it's just going to come a lot easier to talk about and for you to do. And it, you'll just get better with every video. So that's why it's important to stay consistent and post often. Yeah. Ask around, how many of these people do you know? No one. How many of them know you? None, right? So if they want to judge for you having a camera, oh, a tripod, fuck them. Like, if you're, you're it literally- more about themselves. Yeah, it, it does say yeah, more about sure. themselves. And if you're trying to make content, inspire other people, and people are hating on you because of that, that says a lot about them. Yeah. They're idiots. You're trying to help and inspire, motivate people, and they're hating, who gives a fuck, bro? Yeah. Who gives a fuck? Literally, like, and even if you don't start, you know, hitting crazy numbers right away, um, people you know from, like, your high school, or like your friends like in your area they're gonna see your videos and they're either one gonna get inspired or two they're gonna clown right yeah and if they're gonna clown we already talked about that that's on them you're trying yeah. to do you're trying to do good and they're gonna clown but you're also gonna inspire a lot of people you know personally because when i started posting it wasn't really like popular to post you know on tiktok and stuff so yeah. i think people saw my videos and they were like damn like because the, a lot it's it's pretty well known that it's like it's scary to post kind of like it's a bit intimidating yeah. so i get i think people saw that and kind of respected me a bit more for putting myself out there That's you know and then they got the motivation to either want to one work out yeah or two maybe post content or both yeah. and yo think of it by you not posting you could be potentially holding back motivation from other people because let's say you see my videos and you got inspired but when the kids at school would clown me for making videos and i stopped i would have held that motiva motivation back from you which would have been selfish on my part so by you not posting content, you're selfish. Yeah. Nah, I'm playing. My friend and I were like, we were like a little kind of like skeptical about it, like yeah. recording and stuff like that. And sometimes we get nervous, like, no, we're not recording. There's too many people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we've been doing it more and more and more. And it gets easier. And like people from my high school and stuff like that, they look at my videos and stuff. And everybody's like positive about it, which Literally. I wasn't really expecting. Exactly. And it's kind of funny because I've been posting, like, I, I've always had like, super like insecure like body image and stuff like that mm. and as i've been getting bigger and stuff like that i'm becoming more like confident in myself yeah. i'm like you know what like it doesn't it's really not that deep it's really not so because more, yeah and, and now that i've been posting more and stuff like that it's kind of funny because my ex is like stalking my no now. way so yeah <laughs> she's regretting yeah, shit yeah. she's regretting shit so my buddy and i we've been having a hell of fun <laughs> yo yo let me get your instagrams that's hype what but yo, there's nothing to be insecure about. There literally is nothing to be insecure because you're. I seen your physique. You're jacked. How old are you? It's like 17. You're jacked, bro. Like you're saying, like you're kind of insecure, like your body image issue, or whatever you said. Like, is it because you like compare yourself to other people, like online and like I on TikTok? Myself to run on steroids, bro. But, but why? That makes zero sense. Like, think of I it for a second. I don't, know. I don't. I think about it in theory, and I'm just like, yes. Wait a minute. It makes no sense. Grown men. Grown men. Grown men. Their full time job yeah. is to work out, eat, sleep, train. That's all they have to do. And bro, you're 17. It, look at other kids in your school. You're, I'm sure you're more jacked than them. Like, you're good. I started off here at 94 pounds. Jeez. That was three years ago. Yeah, let me see. Um, Whoa, you didn't want to fly because you wanted to be humble. Okay, okay. Like, can we show the camera? A little transformation here. I was like two, three years ago. Drop the gear and disappear hard. This guy's got the structure too. 
Bad. Yeah, bro, keep posting. You got a good aesthetic physique. Oh, yeah, you're fine. That's me right now. Hey, but it's good for you both to be in the videos, you know, feedback, like feed off of each he's other. Got crazy ass genetics, though. Yeah, like, yeah, he's like, being humble. He's being humble. He even... Literally, I'm worried, like today, I'm working on a video on everything I did to grow it. Like, I'll definitely check in it out. good yeah. detail, in I'll good detail. And the YouTube videos are better than any shit I post. The shit I post is basic, typical on Instagram and stuff, but YouTube, I, I think it's more uh, interesting kind of All thing. All right, yeah. We'll probably, yeah, we can probably start. Like posting YouTube videos, bro. Do it, YouTube bro. YouTube Shorts is the method, really. Cause, yes, because ah, YouTube Shorts is the same as TikTok and Instagram, like reels or whatever. But you can link your long, long form videos to your short using like just spam yeah, posts and right, yeah. link it to okay, your long form, bro. Video on that stuff like that. Do it, bro. It'll probably drop, it'll probably drop. Uh, Maybe Saturday, maybe Saturday. Saturday. Right, yeah, yeah, but if you follow my Instagram, whatever. Like it Yeah, literally, bro. We're gonna take fucking notes. Pen and, and shit, paper yeah. and shit? Bro, trust me, it's a good yeah. detail, so. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I appreciate it. Anytime, yeah. bro. I got you, bro. Yeah, good one. Thank you, bro. Yeah, See you guys good. around. Yeah. Baby girl. I'm the man from the BBA. I pull up in Lexus like it's 07, I just hit a lick, I gotta hit the next one Last year I know you learned your lesson, I could GPS you if you need a dressing Boss up, I'm the bigger homie, but I'm one year older than my little homie 09, they was bidding on me, but I'm young, money got it written on me Okay, now we got some action, everything I said it happened That boy light is Michael Jackson, but on verses he been blacking Chasing women a distraction, they want me on TV right next to me You cannot be here right next to me don't you see Riri right next to me? I hate a rapper especially They feel the same but they hide it They just discuss it in private Don't get alone man we tried it What's the point in even trying? I hate a goofy especially They always dying to mention me They gotta die out eventually I cannot give you the recipe You know the game is so separately Swear I just had an epiphany It cost me 50 at Tiffany's Shout out to Tiffany Stephanie I always come check for me My enemies wanna be friends with my other enemies I don't let it get to me Done Look what I done in my life I had to count it, then count it again To make sure the money was right They love to talk Me, I'm just done in the hype Me, I'm just done in the hype Me, I'm just done, 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 done I don't take this shit for granted I do my own propaganda I feel like June Santana Leg hanging out the fan up Six cold like Alaska Views already a classic Roy out of here like NASA Bustin' ones out the plastic A gram too poppin' the fuck of the chain Too heavy to tuck it, I'm serious I feed my family with this So don't play with my money this summer, I'm serious I don't run out of material You shouldn't speak on me, period You try to give them your side of the story They heard it, but they wasn't hearing it they feel in the way. All right, just finished up chest. Just gonna hit some abs, a little bit of stairmaster, and then uh, we'll pick it up when we get back to the house. Probably cook up a meal, and then uh, we'll see what else we do tonight. All right, just got back from the lift, and we got a meal here. It's probably about like just 200 grams of ground chicken. Normally, I'd add in a little bit of rice, but we're in a bit of a rush. Uh, we're thinking we're gonna head to the beach, a little downtown area here. Uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna eat this up quick. And then we're gonna head out. A little physique check if you guys were curious. I don't I don't know if it's the jeans or me, but I'm definitely feeling pretty lean. 